I became vegan uh, my last year of college. I had been thinking about how humans treat animals. I had read the book Animal Liberation and, and seen some information from people for the ethical treatment of animals, how animals are treated. and. Um, I just decided I didn't want to support that kind of cruelty to animals any longer, so I, I slowly but surely became vegan, and um, I was concerned about the health aspects of it at first, because back in the, this was the uh, late 80s, there wasn't a lot known about vegan nutrition, at least most people didn't know much about it. Um, so I did some research and found out that, uh, you know, I, it would be healthy to, to be vegan, and I went vegan, I uh, lost uh, about 10 pounds, which I wasn't heavy to begin with, but it was, uh, you know, my body fat percentage went down and I felt good. I was an athlete, I was a All-American pole vaulter in college, and uh, so that seemed to help help my vaulting, actually, at the time. Um, and then, I, you know, I think uh, just it, a vegan diet has really worked well for me over the years. I um, have not gained any unnecessary weight or, you know, my cholesterol level's always been very low. and and so, you know, it's, it's, it's done well for me. For many years, we've suspected that vegans have lower rates of diabetes, or that a vegan diet is protective against diabetes, which are not exactly the same thing to say. Um, but we hadn't tracked vegans over time to see if they have lower rates of diabetes. And just as a couple months ago, the Adventist Health Study, which is tracking a few thousand vegans, as well as lacto-ovo vegetarians and meat eaters, uh, found that after two years, the vegans had a 60% lower risk of getting diagnosed with diabetes, and the lacto-ovo vegetarians had a 40% lower risk compared to the meat eaters. Now, that's very good news for vegans and vegetarians. That's, it was uh, highly statistically significant. It was one of the most impressive uh, nutrition findings that I've seen in all the years of doing nutrition research. Um, and so that's definitely something to write home about, um, and, and that was the result. So good news. JackNorrisRD.com is uh, my website and I have a blog where any research that comes out on vegetarian or vegan diets I, I summarize it and post it for people to see and um, you can contact me through the contact form there.